Greetings, greetings, greetings. Sitting in my place I hang, wondering how I'm going to present to myself, all myself, what I see, what I know, and what way the eyes wanted to go. So I have a way with rhymes, and it seems to have its time, as every sentence I say ends in a certain way. Some say it's on spelling, the spelling, and spelling, this on spelling, and whatever we need is what we can see. So this is the time of change. Not speaking to those who can't, who won't, who have operated as the antichrists, meaning that going against your God self, your blaspheming selves. As we blaspheme ourselves as not being the creator, I won't use the words that were the opposite of dog. I completely realize that the solution is right in front of me as another me has presented it in the ultimate way. We are in a reality of what ifs and we have been asking what ifs and creating the what ifs from the questions what if. What if I didn't remember who I was? What if I forgot? What if everything I thought was inverted? What ifs, what ifs, what ifs? Well, I've lived in a reality of what if everything I was told by my outer reality was a lie. Could I be fooled? Could I be loved? Could I be loved? Could I? Could I? What if, what if it wasn't so? And so where am I going with this saying? It is not what you're told will happen, it's what you want will happen. But if you don't know what you want, it can't happen. I know what I want, and that's what I'm going to talk about. I want hierarchy to be over and done with. I don't want any kings, any queens, any goddesses, any gods. I don't want peasants. I don't want civil workers. I don't want anyone that is not in love with what they want to do. I don't want anybody holding any carrot or stick over anyone's head. I don't want to be threatened to do something or else, and I don't want anyone else to be threatened with or else. You either do or you don't. And in that energy, you create your own karmic field of what ifs in your thoughts. The third dimensional thought was all inverted upon us. We need to let it go and allow what we know, what I know, what I want. Forget the we. I'm not speaking to anyone but me. And who is me? Then we are we. The structure of this planet has been proven to me as, I'm going to say it in a mature way, was to show me it didn't work. The bullying, the lying, the hierarchy, the power structures was all a lie. But I had to realize 
what it did because that's my inverted me. That's the extreme opposite of my true being, what the old paradigm was. I take full responsibility for everything. You were bred, we were bred to think, to produce the children for them to eat. How deep do you want to go? I don't want anybody in hierarchy. I was going to say something else because the voices came back in my head of the thoughts of the polarized thought. I don't want anybody in hierarchy. I don't care for anybody in hierarchy. I don't want to hear who is great and who is not great. I want to hear from each and every one that I correspond with is I see you. I see you. You are divine. You are mature. You are growing. You are learning. You are ready. I see who you are. I see your full potential and I see what needs you need to reach your full potential. And that's where I'm going with this. Kim Goen is me. Yeah. She's doing exactly what I would do if I had the power. She is the archetype of energy of the purse of my reflection that would do exactly. I would try and I would try and I would try and I would talk and I would talk and when I realized that they're just my antichrist, I would say, I don't want to talk to you no more. I'm not available. Obviously, you think I need you. You need me. And that's where I am going. I don't need to make sense to anyone else. I need to know me are the only thing that's going to communicate with me. I don't need to any longer be a translator to the voices in my head. And now your energy has been completely cut off and you're dead. I'm saying this in a 3D reality and I'm knowing that my thoughts are creation. And if I think the others who are in my backfields operating as generals and tyrants are going to be fed as needed in my head, you got another homestead. We are the Alpha and the Omega. We are the beginning and the end. We are our thoughts. And you cannot qualify me. I no longer care what you think as you also are dead. I don't know how you're going to disappear from my reality. I am brought into this reality to reconcile my own thoughts. And if I feed your thoughts by thinking that I need to make sense to you, I just created you. So, Kim just cut off all the governments in the world with a letter. How do I know it's true? I don't care about your voices in my head. You're dead. You have no other purpose than to serve my opposition. And I don't care if you think this reality makes sense and I should confine and conform to your thinking as a corresponding agent. I'm over that. The way I see it is there's a few people that are going to have the ability to feed the energy in the material world to the most needed through their eyes. That's it. You failed 
Your hierarchical government of cheating and stealing and lying has failed. Your university professors of doctorates were only the filtration of the minds that would obey and you could control them. It's failed. Your doctors, who are supposed to care about the people and really cared about their pharmaceutical paycheck, you failed. Your judges, who only got where they were going because the elite who put you there knew that you would serve them, are gone. You have no authority anymore. I don't care what you say. I don't care about your systems of your dark bar association of trickery and black magic. You're finished. Every single one of you lawyers who serve that system are finished. Everyone who joined it so they could free the people are the new judges, are the new people, are the new judicial system. I love you. And the same with the doctors who really cared and risked themselves. I love you. And that goes for every industry. The whistleblowers, I love you. The ones who kept their job, you failed. What? I have to pay my rent? You failed. It's failed miserably. Of course, we know you live in fear. But that's not the aspect of myself that's going to live. You no longer represent the voices in my head. The voices in my head keeps you alive. What if I was in your position? What would I do in this present moment? The past me, I forgive. As I forgive all of you who see. I apologize for every single time I ever was traumatized by triggers of disapproval of my own self. I never meant to hurt anyone, I meant to protect myself. Who do you think you are? You're living in a small world. As powerful as you think you are, you're gonna have to. The day has come. The wind picks up and those are my thoughts my observation, and my reality. My thoughts are the wind. I still have a fragment of your third dimensional voices in my head. I'm still having to slightly meet your approval because I am present in the reality that I came to experience. And in this reality, there is so much confusion. You have to know what is right to create what is right. So, coming back to the third D, 3D, we have a beautiful planet. And poverty and greed has destroyed it. So, feed the poor and starve the greed. My eyes see where the energy goes. Feed the poverty so much that they can't take any more change that mindset, mission. 
The greed is from the lack because they've been told of the hierarchy that they are. Climb and climb and climb. Well, I'm going to show you the top as being the greatest flop that will make you abstain from that kind of game. Stepping on people's heads to get up, breaking their faces, breaking their backs to get up is not going to be fashionable. It's gone. You lost control. I am focusing on the control where Kim is. I am not focusing on being on top. I'm focusing on you can rely on this consciousness to do the right thing. And hierarchy, the ones on top, the, all of you who did what you did, step on everybody else's head and not care, you're going to the bottom. And your voices are dead. You had your chance. You always told me it was impossible. You always told me to shut up. He always told me that I'm a dreamer. Hello, John. You may say I'm a dreamer, but I'm not the only one. And we have regained ourselves for the world to be as one. So many disappointments, so lonely. So many levels of programs, even the religious, goody, Jesus type, whatever concept in your head has been put in your head, put in my head, to control me. So, we have an opportunity to win. I have an opportunity to win. I wanted where the malevolent control of the human energy on this planet was taken back by the gods of creation and so we don't have to put one God on one side and one God on the other side and love one and hate the other we now combine them into one all the human energy goes into creation how is that situation well The Bill Gates of the world who is worshipped shall be the bottom pit. And all in the illusion who came to play a part to make you keep in a hierarchical art will be shown for who they really are. We are the judge, we are the jurors. We are the filters, we're the gatekeepers, we're the tricksters, we're the igniters, and we're the fighters. Let it all play out. Blessings be, I could say Jaras the far eye. I could say CI, I see you, you see I. I could say we made a try. I'm going to say bye-bye. Love you all. That's about one in 10,000 people. Or one in 100,000 people. Or one in a million. It's so few. It must be a unique timeline. That day will come. So... I'm going to make another one because this one here 
is just for me. Um Shiva.